Hello and welcome back to absolutely beautiful autumn day here at Bransford Webbs. Well it's been a few weeks since we did the last video. Um, Sarah and myself and a few of the sales team have taken some well-earned holiday at the end of a busy spring and summer period. But we're all back now and this week you're joining me in Liner House 1. And normally this is where we grow our 9 centimetre young plants. We pot on from the plugs that we've either propagated here on site or that we've bought in. And we bought them up through a liner stage. We just finished the big Hebe pot of the year, so all our 2025 Hebe's are down on the ground and in the glass house is growing away nicely. Um, and we fill this space up that's had Hebe liners in here with a primula crop. So these have just been potted um, two weeks ago, and um, this is Rubens, this is Rubens Sky Blue. So you can see um, just a little plug gone into the one litre pot there, that'll be growing away nicely, and then we'll get that out. Rubens will last the flower, so that'll probably arrive in garden centres mid to late February next year with that lovely ruffled um, dusky blue flower to it. Um, but a good range of primulas on, on, online now, so not online, on site at the moment, shall I say, growing away nicely. Um, so check out our um, range in our 2025 brochure. Hopefully uh, you're seeing your sales team at the moment coming out to do your 2025 reserves. If not, they'll be in touch soon to book an appointment with you. But on a beautiful autumn day like this, it's perfect to get into the garden. So our temperature's still nice and warm and we've got some good sunlight and good um, temperature coming off the sun too to help things just get growing and keep putting that root down into the autumn. So with that in mind, we've got some really nice um, things online that will fit that autumn planting. First of all, it's a really nice range of Escalonia. So we have got in our Escalonia range, we've got Red Dream, looking nice there, loaded in bud. We've got Gold Bryant to give you that nice bright foliage colour and we've got Ivy Eye, so you've got a nice white flower contrasting Red Dream. So, all together they make a really nice Escalonia collection. Evergreen, some pretty much bulletproof in most gardens and will just um, yeah, perform really well to give you that really good core structure. The other thing that's looking really good at this time of year is hellebores. So those of you who had them, you'll see that our 4 litre Viv um, bred by Microflow in Belgium have um, come online and most of those are in garden centres now. That's a nice 4 litre, very early flowering Orientalis type, a uh, mixture of doubles and singles and um, pattern flowers too. So they're out in garden centres now, loaded in bud, loaded in flower, looking really nice. And the next ones to come online are um, varieties like this. So this is Maestro in a two litre. As you can see, it's got this lovely dusky pink flower. Nice yellow stamens in the middle that contrast it really well. The first flower's just opening, loads of buds are coming underneath and loads more coming up from the base. So that's two litre Maestro. And the same breeding as that, we've also got Jasper which is a pure white one. And again, the first buds are just starting to open and loads more of Sarah zooms right into the crown there. You can see we've got loads of bud coming up. So that's gonna give you shelf life and impulse um, sales right the way through to Christmas and beyond now, as do the Vivs range that's already out there. And last but not least, actually not last, but I've got another one in a moment, but um, coming through with flower on it is um, Snowdrift. So again, Snowdrift, really nice, compact, um, habit to it, really dense when you see the amount of foliage on there and you just see the first flower buds are coming up and we really like snowdrift because that's got a sort of anemone double um, centred flower to it, it's really strong, very um, pure white flower but just with that extra bit of detail, great for the front of the border, actually great for a pot near the back door or front door on the way up to Christmas, so that's an anemone snowdrift, not an enemy, Calibor, so you can tell I've been off for a few weeks. Um, and also, last but not least, we've got our Harvington Hybrid series. So check out the full range of these online. Um, the range keeps changing week on week as they flush through their autumn flush. These won't flower until next spring, but arguably are probably some of the best orientalist types you can put in your garden. Once established in your garden, these just get stronger and stronger and stronger. And the amount of flower they produce year on year is phenomenal. But the best thing to do is get this planted now, plant it in the autumn, and then you can reap the rewards of that and the flower colour in sort of March, February, March next year, um, when a traditional Orientalist type would flower and they come in the two litre deep pots. So there you go, we've got a nice range of evergreen shrubs online at the moment. Also some flowery herbaceous with things like the um, hellebores, there's a few saxophages knocking around still, which are looking really nice. So check out the full availability and we'll keep popping back every two or three weeks as the hellebore range changes through the autumn. Goodbye for now.